Hello, welcome to Hyper Network's Telltale Batman speculation video number one, Game Mechanics. This will be the first time in a Telltale game you are playing the game as two separate characters, in a way. With that of course being Bruce Wayne and his alter ego, Batman. With that being said, just as was stated at South by Southwest, there will be times when we will be able to approach situations in the game where we will be picking between Bruce Wayne or Batman for said situation. Could this mean the gameplay might be very different when going back between each character throughout the story and determine player's choice depending on their preferred gameplay? And this segues into gadgetry or accessories being used in this game very differently than other Telltale games. For example, having Bruce use his watch or some other doohickey to scan areas and look for clues within investigations versus actually looking around for objects to use. Or another idea could be having Batman have multiple ways of handling a situation from remotely hacking certain objects via watchdog style, you know, to maneuver events or physically knocking down opponents in the way, or simply using darts or some other bat gadgets to take down criminals or you know the old-fashioned literally beating them up and to jump onto another game mechanic is a little iffy since the mixed reception of the batmobile inclusion of arkham knight but how about options for transportation with certain choices of course determining not only the form of entry to a certain place being direct or stealthy but also allowing for either a guns of blazing effect or a strategic form based on the player's decisions including killing or not killing etc etc Lastly, a feature that has yet to be introduced in any Telltale game is of course, skins. If this were to ever be done in a Telltale game, which we don't know if it's even possible, could they or would they implement them? You know, skins being in the game with examples being different suits or vehicle styles. That kind of fan service hasn't been hated on yet, so I don't see it being a problem now other than it probably being DLC'd. Or maybe it could be free as the devs could do it for fun. Well that's it for this Telltale speculation. Leave your thoughts on the comment section down below and leave a like if you enjoyed it. And of course, subscribe to see more Hybrid Network content. Peace, I'm out. I'm Batman.